In Broncos news, Peyton Manning is commenting on the Wes Welker drug suspension. Welker was suspended for four games by the NFL yesterday for testing positive for amphetamines. The Denver Post reports it was from Adderall. Today, the team hit the practice field to get ready for the first month of the season without Welker. And Peyton brought an optimistic view. Uh, it's, a, it's an opportunity for some um, certain receivers to get more playing time, you know, whoever that is. A Welker will not be able to return to the team until week six of the season. And medical professionals are weighing in on the use of Adderall, which is becoming increasingly popular in sports. Yeah, KRDO News Channel 13's Greg Miller talked to the staff at UCCS about the dangers of that drug. College medical professionals will tell you it has been on campus for years. It's a drug that a lot of students use to stay up late at night and to focus. But now, allegedly, it's made its way to the football field. But it looks like it's actually filtered over to the athletic program as well. Adderall, typically prescribed for ADHD patients, has been used by college students recently, especially during final season. Now, it's alleged to be used in the NFL. The NFL considers it a performance-enhancing drug. Not performance like I'm going to get stronger, I'm going to get faster, but performance like I'm going to think sharper, I'm going to think quicker. Dr. John Torres was not surprised to hear the accusation that Adderall made its way into professional sports. If I do have a concussion, there are some reports that some athletes are taking it for concussions to try and get around the testing that keeps them off the field. Officially, Welker tested positive for an amphetamine, and one source told the Denver Post he tested positive for Adderall. NFL.com cited another Post article in 2013 that many NFL players reportedly use Adderall as a cover up for other drugs because the NFL drug policy does not allow the league to say which drug caused a player to fail a test. When they test for amphetamines, they're testing for a whole spectrum of different types of amphetamines. Adderall is actually two different medicines, dextroamphetamine and amphetamine combined. So it's going to light up on an amphetamine test. Adderall is a prescription drug, which when used by a patient doesn't carry a heavy risk of side effects. But when used by other people... Or from causing more inattention, causing impotence, uh, causing rashes, that type of thing, to more serious ones, it can cause heart attacks. So it increases your heart rate, it can cause um, um, problems, even death. In Colorado Springs, Greg Miller, KRDO News Channel 13. We checked with athletic departments at several high schools, all of which say they don't condone the use of Adderall or any enhancing drug among players of any sports. Well,